I was crap at sport. When I was a kid, I was crap. You should see me on sports day. I was in the sack race like that. Right, let me out and I'll do it. <laughs> it's like the egg and spoon race. I was late for the egg and spoon race. I ran with a fucking chicken. <laughs> I used to box. I was brilliant at boxing. I always came like second. <laughs> Third if there was a ref, you know what I mean? <laughs> Trying to ban boxing, that'd be great, wouldn't it? Just the ref in the ring on his own going like that. <laughs> and then you got the girl going around with the numbers. This girl, you're like, ah, number two. What a crap jump for a woman, that is. You never get that in any other sport, do you know what I mean? You wouldn't get like a woman running around the track at the Grand Prix going like, that, number two! <laughs> <laughs> no, it's like, uh, <laughs> something I've been learning uh, this week, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to uh, do for you now. I actually went to the circus this week and uh, I watched this bloke who, uh, who actually dedicated his life to the ancient Chinese art of plate spinning. And I watched him and within a week I'd learnt it, so what a twat he was. <laughs> Fucking pack it in. <laughs> but uh, I'm gonna do for you now. I'm gonna do for you now. There's a bloke there going, he's fucking mental, I reckon he's mental. <laughs> I'm so sorry. But uh, I'd like to do for you now, ladies and gentlemen, um, what I've learned in the way of plate spinning, and it goes like this. Thank you. <laughs> People are going to ask, shit, what's all that about? <laughs> I'm sorry, these are meant to be real plates. Yeah, clank, 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 clank. <laughs> Slide, clack, clank, 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 clank. <laughs> I don't know, it's like, uh, look at that white stuff look, from the towel. <laughs> you know. <laughs> Scare, clank, 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 clank. <laughs> <laughs> But, uh, I don't know, it took me four days to build that. What a fucking waste of time that was. It really was. <laughs> I'm there in the shed banging away. My wife's going, like, what are you doing? I said, I'm building a plate spinning machine. She went, I'm, I'm leaving you. You know what I mean? <laughs> I, don't know, I bought a cabinet the other day from MFR. I was putting it together with a little mo like that. Oh, it's weird. You're kind of putting this cabinet together like this, right? The most important screw, the one that holds it all together. Sting! <laughs> Always, they make the screw the same fucking colour as your carpet. Always. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody move! Nobody move! Isn't it strange when you look at something, you, something comes up you're looking for six months ago? You go like, ah, right, me shoe! <laughs> me shoe! I swear I've got me shoe, haven't I? <laughs> it's like, uh, I bought, a, I don't know, I bought an extension lead the other day. What is it with extension leads? You kind of wrap them all up nice and neat, you hang them in the cupboard, you shut the cupboard, you go away for two minutes, you come back, open the cupboard, the fucking. <laughs> Is it? Somebody nips in your ass and goes, oh, fuck it. <laughs> uh, like, uh, <laughs> went to, oh, well, I went to the early learning centre the other day. I can't work out how to get in there, can you? I can't. <laughs> I bought a water purifier and I shit in it and said, sort that liar. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. But, uh, I don't know. I, 
So sort of don't get on with shops. I hate shops when they make you feel guilty. Do you know what I mean? It's like when they hold your money up. You've been in a shop and they, because they don't look at the money, they look at you. So your reaction is, they go like that, they go like that. <laughs> do you know what I do? As soon as I get the change, I hold this. I go, fucking you're on it, you're on it. <laughs> Even the coins, fucking you're on it. It's like those big cameras and boots. You know the big ones? You can feel them come around. You see the red light come on. You sort of stand there. It makes you feel guilty. You go like that. <laughs> Sorry, smash. <laughs> smash. <laughs> Bit of an echo. Takes a while to get here, you know what I mean? <laughs> but, uh... <laughs> don't know, it's like, uh... It's like menswear shops. You've got a menswear shop, because I can't handle it. You go to a menswear shop, you know, and the music's like... <laughs> and the bloke's there going... Oh, yeah, great, everything's great, yeah! There's always a woman at the counter going, like, oh, <laughs> I've been trying on, I mean, fucking go and try them on, you know what I mean? <laughs> going the little flappy doors, you know, in the cube, they're always checking up on you. Everything all right? Everything all right? No, it's not actually, you're getting on my fucking nerves. When a bloke comes out of that cubicle, his trousers are that long. Go like, ah, what do you think, love? What do you think? You're fucking all right, aren't they? <laughs> Who are they for? That's the average man, that is. What's he wearing? Stilts? What's happening? <laughs> it's like women, like, like ladies, you've got your buttons on the left, we've got ours on the right. What's that? What? I don't understand that. Why? We're not going to confuse a blouse, are we? We're not going to put a blouse on and go, oh, it's got cups! <laughs> it's yours! <laughs> so I never got the system because like, like ladies got the v-shape like that and we got the crossbar you know what i mean mm, lovely for catching your nuts on thank you very much <laughs> they should have airbags on there you go <laughs> oh. Because, you know, I hate shopping my wife. I hate it. Oh, it's annoying. You'll always find me at the veg counter in the supermarket, one of those bags going, oh, I can't get it open, I can't get it open. <laughs> it's when your wife walks up to go, you got it upside down. <laughs> so, you ever walking down the high street with your wife and you're talking merrily away like that and they go off and look in a shop window, you t find yourself talking to a complete fucking stranger. <laughs> It's like, uh, it's like when you leave something behind. Do you ever left something behind in a calf or something like that? And you don't want to turn directly around in the high street because everyone thinks you're fucking mental. So what you do is you make a big display of it. You show everybody you have forgot something. You go like that. Oh, I forgot something. <laughs> Case. You either do that or do what I do is I cross the street and then I go back. I go, I don't think no one's noticed. I don't think no one's noticed. Brakes in the, on the high street, a bus will pull up next to you and go, <laughs> <laughs> they know they're doing it. Look at the driver's face like that. <laughs> they should have get something sorted out and they should put bar, like party blowers on them or something like that. They roll up and go, <laughs> <laughs> so they have testers, didn't they, in supermarkets? Testers, that's where you go and go, I'll well, try a bit of tea, I'll try a bit of caca. <laughs> Why don't they do testers for bog roll? That'd be great, wouldn't it? <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's really good. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry. That bloke there's gone out. Oh my god. <laughs> sorry, sorry. I don't know, I've stepped in I don't know, I've stepped in dog's crap in the high street before. I have stepped in the high street, you go <laughs> and then you spend the rest of the time trying to like kind of going, oh look, look we should go to <laughs> Oh, I fancy running down the old McDonald's, actually. <laughs> yeah, come on, let's go, come on. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> Weird. <I> don't know. <laughs> God, blimey. He just saw worm now. It's like the worst thing in the high street, I think, well, it makes me laugh anyway, is that bloke outside McDonald's. You seen that bloke outside McDonald's? I think his name's Malcolm, I think. <laughs> 
I'm sure of it. It's a bloke outside McDonald's with a McDonald's uniform and with a peak cap and a black sack going like that. Got to keep a street clean. <laughs> oh, 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 got to keep a street clean. Oh, oh, oh no, it's not a McDonald's. <laughs> I don't get on with restaurants at all. You ever walk in a restaurant and there's two of you? Walk in a restaurant, there's two of you like that. I guarantee the waiter will come over and they go, table for two. <laughs> Wait a minute, let me count. <laughs> One, two, yes, fucking please. <laughs> Ugh. What is on that towel? So I saw a sign the other day, all you can eat for five quid. I went back the next day and went, well, I ain't finished yet. It was only for the one day. It didn't fucking say, did it? <laughs> I'm angry. So Pizza Hut, you go to Pizza Hut, right? Guarantee somebody will walk up to you in Pizza Hut and they go like that. Hi, would you like to save for the salad bar? <laughs> uh, yes, please. What do they give you? A fucking egg cup. This is what they give you, right? <laughs> they give you a plate the size of a contact lens. Take whatever you like. Yeah, if I had the fucking plate, I would. <laughs> You can see people over the salad bar trying to force sweet corn into it going, go get a fucking salad out, it's good! <laughs> you don't want to walk back to your seat with a big pile of food, everyone's going, greedy bastard, greedy bastard. Small <laughs> plate! <laughs> so what was the one I went to the other day? Oh, 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 a TGI Fridays, right? American style restaurant. Well, they're mental. They're mental, I don't know, it's like an American, like have a nice day, all that kind of stuff. You know, I walked in, I was up all night working, I went in, sat in a booth like that. There's a, <laughs> this bloke come out of the kitchen, he went, <laughs> <laughs> Yes, you are, aren't you? <laughs> what are they on in there? I reckon and then the kitchen going like that. <laughs> She worked out a really good way to get them back. I'm serious. What you want to do is be the same as them. Just before you go in, right? Just before you go through the door, get yourself prepared, then burst through the door and go like that. Ha! <laughs> they can't handle it. They go like, oh my God, he's the same as us. 